Class 2A semifinal action from Walter Boyd Field in Moroa. As the Trojans of Moroa Forsyth played host to DeCoin. DeCoin knocked off Tri Valley last week while the Trojans bested El Dorado. Trojans with the ball, and they get on the board first. Tyler Ray finds Cam Boleyn wide open. Touchdown Trojans, they're up 7 0 in the first quarter. DeCoin would answer back in the second. Caleb Vogel hands it off to Zane Fournier. He takes it in for the score, and we're tied up at seven going into halftime. In the third, more to coin, misdirection play. We lost him there. There it is. Leads to a Devin Jones leaping grab, 14-7 to coin. Then on the kickoff, it's fumbled by the Trojans on the five, goes into the end zone, and DeCoin's going to recover. They lead at 21-7 in the third. We head to the fourth. And Royal Forsyth would get going. After Jackson Nelson pick, Tyler Ray, he finds DeAndre Gregory, and he is gone down the sideline. 21-14, Trojans trail, nine minutes left in the fourth. DeCoy with the ball, Vogel rolls out looking. He's going to throw it to the other side of the field, and Jackson Nelson is there for the pick. Then as his second pick of the fourth quarter, the kid is jacked. The Trojans are still alive. Tyler Ray, he's going to thread the needle to the Andre Gregory, and he is going to take it the rest of the way to the house. Down two touchdowns in the fourth. They have now tied it up with seven minutes left. And after another Trojan defensive stop, Tyler Ray is going to hand it off to Jackson Nelson. Takes up the middle. He has room, and it's a foot race, and he's going to win that one. Incredible. Moreau Forsyth now up 28-21 with four minutes left. And after DeCoin turns it over on downs, Tyler Ray, well, he's just going to take it himself to the end zone. Touchdown Trojans. They score 28 points in the fourth quarter with some big defensive plays. And they're going to move on to the two-way semifinals. Moreau Forsyth wins it 35-21 over DeCoin. They play Shelbyville at home with a kickoff at 1 p.m. next Saturday. Uh, unbelievable feeling. Uh, we, we preach and preach and preach to our kids. They sign on for 48 minutes. That's a great ball club right there. Uh, obviously, everything was going against us, and uh, I couldn't be more proud of our kids for stepping up and, and believing in what we do. The biggest thing is we get to come back here, and we love playing at Walter Boyd Field. Uh, haven't played Shelbyville in a while. Used to be in the conference to get together. Uh, I know they have an outstanding group of athletes, and it's going to be another challenge. We're going to go ahead and celebrate this one for about the next 12 hours, and then we'll worry about Shelbyville.